brain. Charge backpack. The genius sisters use them like a lab rat. The neat freak dad at home is super busy mom. But the boy's best friend is a talking dog. Three extreme genes in an air breathing shark. Mega action game control skating in the park. A feral booster bling bling. What do we make of this? Test. What do we think of this? Johnny Test. Johnny Test. This is a laugh of a boy named Johnny Test. Do it. What are we doing first? I was thinking that we might go biking through Europe and work on expanding your vocabulary. Say what? Now, what does nuance mean? Dude, I want sun, I want fun, I want to charge the beach and score some big, fat, tasty waves. Nuance, come on, what does it mean? Okay, I'm not into the beach idea. Oh, don't tell me you're afraid of the ocean. It's complicated. You see, Johnny, back in the day, I was a lifeguard dog. I didn't need to see that. It was a different time, Johnny. A time to be young, to be in love. Is this story gonna take long? I will go and build sand castles, but I will not go in the water. Fine. Now let's go to the beach! Stop right there, Johnny Test. You are not going anywhere until you put sunscreen on first. All right, Mom, sunblock, and... <laughs> so that's how you want to play it. Well, you'll never escape the SPF powers of Sunblock Mom! <laughs> Hey, where are the waves? Gonzo, Johnny Brah. I fear that my dream of riding a wave all the way to Australia will not happen today. You do know you can't surf to Australia, right? Someday, my wave will find me. <laughs> nice sandcastle. Uh, actually, it's a sand mansion, and I'll be inside and away from the water if you need me. No waves? A dog that won't go in the water with me? To the lab! Hey there, great, wonderful sisters. I need you to make some waves. Mondo Bungo waves. The kind of waves that you can ride all the way to Australia. Johnny, we are on the verge of inventing an alternative form of energy so abundant that it will reverse global warming and probably bring world peace. Then who's gonna tell Gil next door, who's at the beach right now, with his shirt off praying for waves, that he can't ride any? Gil's at the beach? I said shirtless, right? This can wait. Ooh, and can you make me a new board, too? One that'll make me an amazing surfer, because I just realized I don't actually know how to surf. How many fins do you want? Johnny Test! Time for you to get sunblocked! Cool outfit, Mom. But you'll never get me, because sunblock is cold and icky! Okay, what's with all the trap doors in this house? By pumping millions of gallons of water onto the ocean floor, you can create any kind of wave you want. And these special satellite cameras monitor the surf conditions. And our special GPS, Gill Positioning System, monitors shirtless Gill next door. Am I totally awesome self-shredding surfboard? I love my crazy sisters and surfing and summer vacation! Yo! Way to rip it up, J! 
Johnny broke. Now this is what I call fun in the sun. <laughs> and this is called SPF 50. <laughs> Darn, that boy's good. <laughs> what are you hiding from? Come on, the waves are amazing. And man, this place is impressive. And so was she, Johnny. Hmm? Her name was Beatrice. She washed up on the shore one day. I saved her by pushing her back into the surf, and she fell in love with me. Hard. But it ended badly. I mean, I'm a dog, and she's a giant sperm whale, right? So you're hiding in a sandcastle so a whale won't find you. It's a sand mansion. Which I now have to rebuild. I told you the waves were huge, and this is going to be the best summer ever. Hit the road, Pee-wee. These are our waves and our beach now! Yeah, you tell him, Moon Kitty. Um, the beach and the waves are for everyone? No, it's for locals only. And I say, we're the only locals. Locals? Moon Kitty? Since when did this become a bad 60s beach movie? Since we fixed the record player. Now come on, everybody! Let's hit those big, tasty waves! <laughs> oh, he has no idea who he's dealing with, does he? You want a big wave, Moon Dorky? Well, here it comes. Johnny, just make sure you don't turn the wave setting past medium. That's like the middle, right? Johnny, you turn it up to tidal wave! No, I turned it to don't even think about it, Johnny. Because that means tidal wave! Why do I hear alarms? Alarms scare Dookie more than whale love. But this guy was a jerk and broke my board, and I don't want to miss this. Listen, weird hair dude. How come you're not in the water? I got to thinking, and you're right. The beach is for everyone, and so are the waves. So, what do you say, Pee Wee? Let's grab a sash together. Gotta love duct tape, right? Yeah, one small problem. Actually, it's kind of big. Okay, I might have overreacted, so turn off the tidal wave before it hits my new surfer buddies, and what's up on Belly Beach forever? Johnny, once the swell has started, there's no turning it off! And Gail is still out there! Oh, I knew my big wave would come in someday. That's a really big, a little too big. <laughs> ah! We have to save the beach, and Gil, and Summer! Johnny Test, it's time for... Yeah, trying to stop a tidal wave here, Mom. <laughs> Johnny, quick! Use your self-shredding surfboard and save Gil! Right! Darn it! <laughs> so you're sure there's nothing you can do to stop that wave? A super strong whirlpool could redirect the swell back out to sea. But where are we gonna get a giant sperm whale to make one? No, I, I can't. You have to! Now slap on your red mankini and call Beatrice, dog. <coughs> Who's, Who's Beatrice? Beatrice? You owe me big time! No time for small talk, my sweet. Make a giant whirlpool for me. Hmm. Um, can we talk about this later? Somebody help! Oh, fine. Yes, you can. Now go! What did you just agree to? Oh, you'll find out. I said! You guys make an amazing wave machine, by the way. Keep swimming, my sweet! Yes! She did it! She saved the beach and she saved my summer! Oh!
Should we call the Coast Guard? Yeah, let him ride. He looks like he's having fun. And tomorrow we'll all come back and have even more fun in the sun. Oh, how it hurts. Well, maybe next time you'll listen to Sunblock Mom. I will. I promise. Oh. Hey, Johnny, who is that? And. Can somebody tell me why there's a whale in our pool? Girls? Girls? I agreed to let her live closer to me. <laughs> it's temporary. So is Gil okay? It's safe to say, little brother, that you gave him the wave he's been waiting for his whole life. <laughs> Welcome to Australia, Mike. Cool beans. This is going to be the best summer ever! <laughs> Ow! As soon as the sunburn goes away. Oh. Whee! <laughs> Two scoops of everything with sprinkles and waffle cones and hot fudge and extra waffle cones! How about two scoops of revenge, Johnny Tess? <laughs> I got it, I got it! Huh? And I got revenge! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> yeah! Tag, you're it! <laughs> revenge, you're it! <laughs> I can't go through life like this. My arms are tired from chiseling you out. To the lab! All you do, Johnny, is enter the makeover machine, then select what look you're going for. Smart, sassy, glamorous, goth, and you have your new look and we will have Gil next door. But I don't care about a dumb makeover machine. I need something that'll stop Brain Freezer from freezing me! Fine. We've been experimenting with thermal nuclear underwear. It withstands cold up to 100 below. And any frozen revenge from Brain Freezer. Awesome! <laughs> I have to test the makeover machine, don't I? What? We had it set for glamorous. Um, I don't think it worked. Get back in, Johnny. <laughs> Still dark and ugly. Go back to glamorous. Well, the goth setting is working, but I don't want goth. I want glamorous! And I want to stop Brain Freezer's frozen revenge. Laters! <laughs> Three, two, one. Hello, Johnny Test. So nice to see you again. <laughs> What gives? Is it me, Brain Freezer? Or is it hot out here? But it's about to get very cold! <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, man, look, he's crying! Don't say it, Johnny. Don't. <laughs> Don't say it. Uh, are you okay? I'm lonely. I told you not to say it! I wasn't always evil. I was just like you, Johnny. A kid with dreams of opening a coffee shop at the university where a jazz trio could play and college kids could unwind with my frozen coffee beverages. Uh-huh, great. Now, skip to the part where you went all nuts. Well, it was a beautiful spring day on campus. I remember she ordered a no-foam latte. She was perfect. Then what happened? I asked her if she wanted to see some jazz with me that night, but she said she was busy. So I lost it, and I vowed to devote my cold heart to wreaking iced havoc as the brain 
my mind. Well, it's set. All we have to do is help you find another special girl, get you a date with her so you'll stop freezing me. Oh, could you, Johnny? I'll stop freezing you. I will. I will. <laughs> Do not laugh. Okay, enough with the pushing. What is this place? I, ah! I need to find Brain Freezer love. So make him over, Psycho Sisters. It's still stuck on goth mode. We'll take it. I mean, have you seen him? <laughs> not much to look at. I heard that. about this, Johnny. Look, BF, clothes make the man. And your freeze suit and helmet are scary and off-putting. But this outfit says, hey, I won't freeze you and be as scary. Now let's get to campus and break in your new look. Vampires! Get up! Vampire! Huh, I guess goth does make you look like a vampire. <laughs> Maybe we need a higher power source. It's still stuck on goth. <laughs> Perhaps you might have some other matchmaking advice for us, since you're girls and we know nothing about your strange species. Girls like honesty. Bingo! A nice girl reading. And she likes coffee. Ah, oh, she's perfect. And by perfect, I mean I'll take anything. Now go up to her and be honest. I'm lonely and nervous, and I've spent some time in jail for trying to freeze pork belly. Ah! I think he was a bit too honest. Try online dating. Okay, all we have to do is fill out this questionnaire and you're in lovey-dovey city. Now, what are your hobbies? Freezing people and seeking revenge. Cooking and playing tennis. Now, what are you looking for in a date? A hot girl who likes iced coffee. Someone to walk with on the beach and talk all night with. Perfect. Now to drag a picture of some handsome guy off the web as your profile picture. Oh, my stars, I'm gorgeous. Now let's pick out your match. Oh, oh, right there, the super pretty one. Coffee Lover 239. Oh, Coffee Lover 239, I can't wait to meet you. I'm Coffee Lover 239. Ah! Kiss me, you fool! Ah! Oh! Ah! Are you really trying to get him a date or just getting your own revenge? Probably a little bit of both. If we could find a portable particle bed reactor fueled with uranium dioxide spheres, it could get the glamour setting working. Oh, okay. And why don't I just pull that out of my... We're striking out big time! Hand. Johnny, girls are complicated, but there are millions out there. Which means you have to have no fear and ask a bunch of them out, and eventually one will say yes. Okay. <laughs> Remember, no fear, don't be scared, and find that special someone. Hey, ladies, anyone looking to chill out with a hot dude? We are horrible matchmakers. I'm dead. <laughs> you know, Brain Freezer might give up the whole dating scene and go back to the revenge scene. Yeah, that has crossed my mind. <laughs> Johnny Test, I am done dating. And now, it's time for your date with revenge from Mega Brain Freezer. <laughs> what the heck is a Mega Brain Freezer? Ask a silly question. Mega cool, right? It violates my probation, but so does my portable particle bed reactor fueled with uranium dioxide ice spheres. <laughs> Just remembered I'm not wearing my thermonuclear underwear. Run. Yep. <laughs> you cannot escape my revenge this time, Johnny Tess. Brain Freezer is gonna blast us. Back to the Ice Age with some particle bed reacting ice spheres. Did you say? 
say particle bed reactor? Yeah, why? Do you need one? We theorize it will fix the makeover machine. I'm gonna need some ice. <laughs> if my freeze ray can't destroy the door, then Mega Brain Freezer will just knock it down! <laughs> Hey, is it me, or is it hot in here? Uh, we might have gone a little too far. What do you think? Yeah, we could pull back a little bit, sure. Hey, hey, don't push, ladies. There's plenty of coffee and meat to go around. Ooh. I'm happy. Brain Freezer's heart is now warm, and he won't freeze me anymore. And like this coffee with two sugars, life is sweet again. <laughs> and so is revenge, Johnny Test! <laughs> oh, please, do you really want revenge, or are you just lonely? I'm lonely. Well, here we go again. <laughs> <laughs> 